now this was the invoice number next is date and after that time and same for the time here we have created this string object because in this operation the time may change okay because time runs on milliseconds so when we will get the width the time may be something and when we will place the text at that time time may be change okay so that's why we are getting one single time and storing in this string object Okay, so let's try to run this and see the result. PDF created and this is the result. Now we need to add table. Okay. So first we will create one object of my table class my table and here document comma content stream next we need to create one array of column width cell width next thing set table and set table font so also set table font now let's create two color one for table header and another for table body
now we need to add items and for that my table dot add cell okay so this is the text comma color so fill color is table head table head color okay now next just copy this now let's run this and see the first line or you can just add one another row and after that we will run now run this pdf created and this is the table same let me add these cells and after this we will add same these lines and when we will reach this we will put background color nil and in this there will be no any text and here background color will be nil and here background color will be table head color so let me add this and after that i will continue okay so Okay, so again run this. PDF created and this is the PDF. Now next thing we need to add this payment method and all these things okay so let add one by one here we are creating array okay so because we have this text in three lines this is first line this is second line
now my text class multi line text payment method at this time italic font and color will be same for the authorized signatory we need to create one line and this text content stream dot move to and this is the first point that is page width minus 250 comma 150 okay and the another point is content stream dot stroke okay now let's add text so text is now we have this text width and here we need to set this in the center of this line and for that first we will get the width then here you can see let me first add x position so x position will be page width minus 250 plus page width minus 25 so here page width minus 250 plus page width minus 25 So this is the page width minus 250 and the page width minus 25. So this is the first position and this is the second position and we need to set here center of these two points. Okay. So my text class dot add single line text text is author sign comma and here x position minus author sign width and divide by 2 okay so this will set it in the center of those two points Cast to int now we need to set bottom line text and one rectangle so first
now get its width bottom line and here page width minus bottom line width divide by 2 comma italic font 20 and color will be dark gray and here alt enter and you can cast to int ok now the next thing we need to add bottom rectangle so color height will be 30 ok and then content stream dot fill ok so I think everything is done so let's run this and see the result ok pdf created and here you can see this is our final invoice ok so friends this was the method that you can use to create invoice using apache pdf box library if you have any doubt in this tutorial then you can definitely write your question in the comment box below I will try my best to resolve your query. Meanwhile, please like this video, subscribe this channel and share this video with your friends. So thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Till then. Bye.